Hey babes and welcome to a new vlog here on the second channel. First of all, yes, I am wearing glasses. No, I do not have a um, wishing, wishing problem? Problem with my eyes. <laughs> I can see very, very clearly without, but I've noticed that every time I fly, I pretty much always fly with someone with glasses and they always look so fresh. <laughs> so I got these um, glasses from ASOS with no, what's it called? It's just normal glass. <laughs> I know, embarrassing, it's very 2010 maybe? Oh well, number two. Today we are going to New York <laughs> and it's so weird to say because it's so far away and uh, it's such a cool place and I've never been there before and I'm really excited. So that is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna take my, where is it, there, my bag and I'm going to go and throw away some stuff before I leave and then head to the train to Arlanda Airport and there I'm gonna meet up with the, the body shop team because we are in New York, <laughs> if you didn't um, understood or have been following the campaign, we are there to uh, hand over the 8 million signatures that we got for the Forever Against Animal Testing campaign that I have been working on for like over a year. It's so weird that it's finally done and that we actually did get more than 8 million signatures, that is crazy. So we are pretty much going to have these shirts all day, every day. <laughs> I won't have any outfits really, I will just have this one. Uh, we will go to the UN and uh, we will just have a lot of fun. Um, so yeah, let's go to the airport. <laughs> now in New York and this is a super quick tour uh, why does that look so gross <laughs> this is a super quick tour of the hotel room I'm on the 23rd floor <laughs> when he said it I was like that's a lot of floors <laughs> um, yeah nine hours flight actually felt okay I felt like it was over super quickly. I only watched two films, um, the new Star Wars and Deadpool, but yeah, we just talked mostly <laughs> on the plane. And this is the bed looking very nice. Let's see if we can see something outside. There we go. Look at that. Okay, someone has to fix these windows. <laughs> They're very dirty, but that is really cool, actually. 
it was actually kind of nice light here i was just gonna say but apparently not <laughs> Okay, like that. So the hotel that we are staying at are the Lexington Hotel. Uh, it's on Lexington Avenue, I think. Uh, it's really cool. As I might have said, maybe not. I've never been to New York, so I'm actually very excited. When we uh, drove here by the car, by the car, in the taxi, <laughs> everything looked like unreal because you've seen it on films and movies and series and stuff like that but never in real life, so it kind of looks fake in a way. Oh my god, my eyes are so red, I just saw. But yeah, we are actually just going to freshen up a little bit and then we're gonna go and head off to a restaurant. And I'm really excited because it's ha it has uh, like a lot of vegan and vegetarian options. And uh, you guys, oh my god, maybe I didn't say on the plane. It was some kind of error and we didn't get any vegetarian or vegan food so the only thing that we ate was crisps <laughs> salted crisps uh, almonds and coffee we got a salad as well that was just salad <laughs> uh, so we are so hungry so yeah we're just gonna freshen up and then head off to the dinner but i don't think that that is that fun to see so i'm actually going to see you guys tomorrow at the dog parade and the entire day the entire day will be so much stuff going on um so yeah see you guys tomorrow good morning everybody i am sitting in bed and doing my makeup i decided to have some fake freckles on today and as usual i put on way too many <laughs> um but yeah today is the life please today is the big day i am wearing my forever against animal test day uh t-shirt oh my god it's so early it's not even six um i'm actually going to have to be ready in like 15 minutes so i'm not really sure how that will go but i will make it of course uh, i'm just gonna put on some eyeshadow some lashes and a lip and then put on my clothes and then head off <laughs> Um, but yeah, I'm really, really excited for this day, actually. I'm most excited about the dog parade. <laughs> Stay tuned for the dogs. <laughs> okay, I am in a bit of a hurry. I have to go down, like, right now. <laughs> but I just wanted to show you guys my outfit. Uh, because we were not allowed to have sneakers or jeans to the FN. Um, as we are going to go in there. <clears throat> and also... Uh, we should have the Forever Against Animal Testing t-shirts on us right now. And then at the FN, we're going to change. So I have a t-shirt with me and my passport, passport with me. And yeah, let's go. <laughs> Just a super quick on the makeup. <laughs> Thank you very much. And here we are. Where's the doggy?
some pictures and now we're going into the United Nations. And I've changed a little bit and I hope that I get in. <laughs> Body shop, and when a Dame Anita Roddick started her first campaign against animal testing back in 1989, everyone thought we were mad. We were taking on the entire cosmetic industry, and now this is one of the biggest trends in the cosmetic industry, which I know you all know intimately in your stores, through your teams, and through your supporters and your fans. So let's take some time to reflect what we have achieved in the past 15 months. Number one, our voices are being heard. We reached our target in a record-breaking 15 months. 15 months to get 8.3 million signatures from a Okay, update time. We were going to the UN, but we were not let in because they thought that we were demonstrating, which we were not. We were all just wearing our Forever Against Animal Testing t-shirts. We had some dogs there. We had balloons, pink balloons, and apparently they didn't like that. Um, and now we were actually going to go there, but Henry that works at the body shop, um, like PR and stuff like that, he specifically said that I think it will be a hard time to get Evelina in. <laughs> so, um, which I get because they obviously saw my green hair and I think that Ida that is with us as well from Sweden, she's kind of fucked as well to get in. Um, and we were not allowed to have any uh, like Forever Against Animal Testing or the Body Shop products on us so they wouldn't understand that we had been there the mor this morning. Um, so we'll see where we're going now. We have been at the United uh, Global somewhere and just been talking a little bit and now I think that we will take a cab and maybe go eat something. Update time. Why am I saying update time? I've got it in for other YouTubers. I don't know her name. Um, but um, where did I end this vlog? I don't remember. <laughs> we were at the UN, we didn't get in. We were shopping, we got back to the hotel. I fixed myself, I've done my makeup again, as you guys can see. And I've also changed into something else. We still have the shirt because we are going to have it at the party later today. Um, now we're just gonna take a glass of wine and then head off to the party. So we'll see what the party will bring. I'm sure it will be a lot of fun. But now I need a drink. <laughs> jumpy and I'm so sorry about it uh, let me get in bed oh my god I'm so tired the thing is <laughs> we were at the event we had amazing vegan food um, but it was like um, small dishes that they came and like gave us so uh, I think I vlogged one of them <laughs> but that's not what I was gonna say the thing is, when I fly to different countries, either if it's just like to London that takes like, does it take like three hours? Or like now, nine hours to New York. I get so tired. And this is an issue because I obviously have to be alert and mingle and stuff like that, but I kind of can't. <laughs> Whenever I fly, I just 
I feel ill. It's like it makes me sick, which is weird. It's probably just in my head, but I don't know. It's probably because it's like stress meeting so many new people. Obviously, this time it's the jet lag. I just love being at home. Obviously, this has been an amazing trip. Um, and we have tomorrow, Friday, uh, Saturday, and then we're going back on Sunday. And we're actually going to get home on Monday. <laughs> so we're flying on Sunday and coming home Monday, which is kind of weird. Uh, but I'm so proud of all that we've accomplished. The 8.3 million signatures is insane and it's such an amazing thing that we did today even though I didn't get to go into the UN and actually hand over the signatures but um oh well <laughs> uh, but yeah you guys uh, that follow me on Instagram will probably see my next few days on Insta story but this is the end of the vlog uh, before I end ooh, I'm just gonna show you guys we got a goodie bag at the event and look they were so quick let's see can you guys find me there you go maybe you can see me that is so cool I love that I'm gonna hang it up on my wall <laughs> um, but yeah that is the end of today and this vlog I hope you enjoyed and I hope that we will see each other in the next video Bye guys.